that is not the right screen. <laughs> what is going on over there? Okay. Uh, so yeah, that's what OBS looks like for everyone. Why is this doing that? That's the... <laughs> I know why. Okay, there we go. I had to unplug my monitors. <laughs> there we go. Hello, everyone. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna finish this. Hey, that's exciting. Um, what are we doing? Murdering some guys? Yeah, sounds right. Poor guy, he probably didn't even know what was going on. <laughs> um. Yeah, so there's this. <clears throat> we do this, and then... This feels weird. <laughs> uh, we're gonna do this, and then we basically attack the capital city. And we're done. So, I don't know how long we're going to be here. Ow. Really hurt. Guess I'm going back. Luckily, my bullets are faster. <laughs> so they're pretty accurate. I'm assuming that's what I did. Whoop. Oh. Oh, they're fun. Are they just gonna keep coming? Alright. Weird. I don't. I don't know. I feel like we've. Uh... Oh, now they're using guns. Okay. I was like... All right, buddy. Just bringing knives to a gunfight. <laughs> I don't think I like this section. <laughs> oh man. At least they're not wearing grass skirts. I should just ran. Thank you. 
Oh, now I can just fly. Oh, that man had a small object. Yeah, uh, that was bound to happen. Okay, try that again. Really? Shot to the face? Didn't kill him? Oh, wait, no, not those rounds. I like that I can't reload while sprinting, but I can reload and then sprint. I appreciate that it doesn't explode until I touch it. Shotgun could actually be good here. I don't think it does enough damage, but we'll see. So you need all this crafting stuff. <laughs> oh. 
Oh. <laughs> um. <laughs> Why did he just lift off? Oh, their lift turns. How advanced. No one else's lift does that. clip per person. I gotta be done now. I like all my ammo. <laughs> charge. There we go. Ha, <laughs> can't get me behind the table, can you? I, oh. <laughs> That'd be really embarrassing if I couldn't get out.
They sure do have a lot of little grenade balloons. A, a big stockpile. Cute. Oh, this guy was just hanging out. Cozy. Sorry, I... He seemed to be just having a good time, just hanging out. He was like, oh, I gotta go kill this man. Hang on. Him and his four roommates. One shot to the arm. That's the way out. Okay. This is President Davis. You, the Ark Volunteers, are mankind's last hope. Our survival. Our very existence. Hooray! It's the same message. That was, that's all my, my ammo. Damn. I did buy a lot of these, so... Back to the pistol. Oh, hey, look, Peltrain. Always been useful to me. Hasn't nothing, nothing in this game. Oh my fucking god, these stairs. There we go. Ooh. A motorized uphill zipline. Oh, am I just standing on something? fun. Best part of the game. <laughs> Very exciting. Oh, there's a little foot thing. Okay, I was like, you just... How's my arm strength? We did it. So go buy more ammo. <laughs> I can't jump over that. Too high. Uh oh. Well, I'll probably come in here next. Why are the jackals right next to the authority? That kind of raises some questions. <laughs> Ooh. 
broom. Go, buddy. Excellent work. Just give me a second to analyze this data. Hey, Captain, take a look at this. Incredible. Incredible's right. This is exactly what we've been waiting for. It is quite simply the key to everything. The location, codes, and re-entry times for every. Oh, you'll hear over here. I was like, how? Right here. How are this you? This data is nothing less than a second chance for civilization. Maybe our last chance. With this, we can strike at the heart of the Authority. We can use the codes in your ID drive to free all the arcs that the Authority has imprisoned beneath the Earth. For years, we've developed plans to get someone inside Capital Prime, into the heart of the monster. But we never had the capability to deliver a fatal blow. Until today. One man if with a lot a of future, guns. Begins with this. The war starts now. First thing is, we need access to the Eastern Lands, and the only way to do that is by knocking out the Authority Security Bridge. See Portman. He's got a plan worked out for that. Uh, You're the explosives guy, so we're gonna blow ready? a hole in the city. To get across the bridge and into the eastern lands, you'll need to knock out the power generator that controls the defenses. Trick is, the only safe way to access the bridge is down the ravine and up the lift. Not easy. Once you're around the defenses, you'll be able to blow the generator to hell. Yep, there we go. Blow it up. <laughs> you just need to make it down the ravine alive. Good. And the Authority has a small blockade near the ravine entrance in the north. Once you blow that, they will know you're coming. Don't waste time. Get down the ravine and to the bridge as quickly as possible. Nah, we'll see. I might get sidetracked by something. Who knows? Though this isn't an RPG, so maybe, maybe not. There won't be a lot of, like, side quests on the way. <laughs> like, halfway in the ravine, there's, like... Save my orphan children. Uh, I don't know. Whatever would distract an RPG protagonist. No is the evil answer. Back to the abandoned distillery. Oh. Around the territories. Wherever that was. Apparently there's an infinite money glitch you can do. Uh, glitch. It's not even a glitch. I know you're working with the you-know-who. A lot of people are pulling for you, and them, so be careful. I gotta be honest, in an apocalypse, it's kind of... I feel like... You should be wearing armor. I mean, you got your upper arms covered. <laughs> I guess you stay in the city, it's a fashion thing. Um, <clears throat> but, like, I can buy these things and sell them. And I actually get more money for it. You'll never know what I'll be selling. And I'm gonna try that. Oh, can I not say it when he's talking? <laughs> I've got the best deals in town. My special deal changes often, so we'll check back again. And here, I bought them for seventy. All my stuff is And I can a sell them for. Who knows if this ever got patched, too. And sell them for 75. It's incredibly slow. But you can Pleasure do it. Doing business with you. Um I picked up some stuff. 
Feel free to look around. Maybe you'll find something you like. All the stuff that I'm not using. <laughs> Yeah, I've got so much stuff. I just I'm not using. Um. Let's okay. Let's Come let's do this instead. Anything. Instead of. Nano. Do you do anything? Those oh. little computers. <laughs> yeah, they scare me. Don't know much about them, but I don't like them. Let's. Just craft a bunch of junk. Uh, I think dynamite bolts actually would be okay. Which is all I'm looking for. I feel like explosives are going to be really good for the authority. <laughs> and then EMP grenade. Which I actually don't need all of them, but they're going to be helpful with the authority, allegedly. Which is three at a time. And last but not least, we're building all the lot grinders. No way I'm going to need seven of them now, but... <laughs> um... There we go. If I don't got it, you don't need it. What you looking for? This is gonna be a hell of a noise. <laughs> Oops. Didn't want to sell all those, but that's okay. How much money did I just make? 3,500. <laughs> I just made a bunch of these into EMP grenades, but that was actually the cheaper option. Uh, we're going to buy... Honestly... <laughs> Max that out. That... I'm not going to need a lot of, uh, rockets, but a bunch of those. And lastly, I'm going to want snipe around. Probably a bunch of them. Hi, LB. There we go. Always a pleasure, my friend. And if I ever need to buy anything else, I'm just going to cheat for money. <laughs> but I don't think I'll need to. Okay, what am I doing now? Right, the abandoned distillery. How are you? Learning about math? <laughs> You're welcome. It's not really about math, it's about numbers, but, you know, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> R8 
sorry, I, I watch smart people you do. <laughs> and then and then you got a, a video about a corsets. So there you go. Like, I don't know what more you could want. before yeah I probably am not gonna uh, I'm gonna use all my shotgun ammo, probably oh we're just doing this again yeah I'm definitely not gonna <laughs> reloads faster. one down there. Sure. All right. I'm the best. Ow. <laughs> I was celebrating how cool I am. Gosh. Climb this these railings, I would probably miss so much more. Oh, he got his head stuck. Hooray! Game, I don't know. I kind of wish this game was harder. <laughs> but like, I, I worry that harder in this case would mean I do less damage and they do more damage <laughs> or something. Just increase the health number. That means difficulty. I got a degree so I could do that with confidence.
Yeah, I knew it. I, this is exactly where I was going. <laughs> Shoot them with my car. <laughs> All right, let's blow it up. <laughs> I don't even think they turned around. Oh, they did. Bye. Idiot. <laughs> Please don't blow up my car. I, I'll need it later. <laughs> Whether you like it or not. <laughs> Just how completely ineffective that is. I could have put my car in the lift. Hey, hey. No, I, honestly, this was better. They would have blown up my car. This is what they're going through now. Probably. No. <laughs> They're not good enough. No, over here is open. Why do we just right next door?
Like, just, like, launch me. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, here's Subway Town. Uh, welcome to Boundary Break. <laughs> we'll take the player anywhere we want. Um, <laughs> uh, there's nothing low enough that's gonna help me here, but that looks pretty cool. Wait, let me get a good look at that thing. Oh, the orb. That's neat. I can't... <laughs> can't zoom in on anything, but... Okay. <laughs> That, that, to be fair, that's only happened once, so... I won't rag on the game for it. Elevators are hard. Which is unexpected. <laughs> okay. Wait for the elevator to stop. Now... <laughs> As I dig deeper into the authority data, I've run across a number of entries alluding to some sort of weaponized mutants or medicine. Oh, yeah, you already told me that. Oh. Great work. That'll make them think twice oh. about getting too far from base. Now, before you go running into Capital Prime, I think you should take some extra firepower with you. Grab that authority pulse scanner. I liberated it from a dead guard. <laughs> oh, perfect. Now oh, the minigun. Awesome. Just what I was looking for. Captain Marshall's got all the plans in place. BFG rounds. You are ready to go. It's not actually a minigun, I bet. You've done a okay. great job, soldier. But now, it gets serious. One last mission for you. Codes are ready. Now it gets serious. Walk right in. Uploading them to you now, sir. This is it, what we've been planning for for so many years coming. But now, we will be able to hit the authority where it hurts. Their major city. You'll have to get inside the heart of the authority itself, Capital Prime. Get to the R control system and upload the data from your ID drive. That'll trigger the emergence of the remaining arcs. No one has ever entered Capital Prime and returned. No one knows what could be waiting for you. But if you are successful you like, raising the remaining arcs, take this code cipher. You'll be able like to that's access kind of a you problem near Capital Prime's main gate. Maybe the entrance will be heavily. That's like a skill issue. I know you can do it. Mankind's future depends on. Okay. You've done so much. Yep, I sure have. Bye, everyone. <laughs> if this wasn't like difficult at all, I would be more interested <laughs> than his people. But it's just sort of like, hi, we're hugely incompetent. One man with a trash gun can walk in and kill like 70,000 people and they're like, oh man, we couldn't do that. You guys can't aim? Am I the only one with like fingers? Like I just have a lot of questions. I love the background, though. That's actually really cool looking. Oh, we got a jump. Hey, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm busy. How am I going to make that jump? I can't just do that. race here. Why does the authority let that happen?
Oh. Gotta go over here. Little tiny door. And this is it. This is the last one. Last mission. Raise your hand if you think the authority is going to be any threat at all. If you raise your hand, you have not been watching. Mmm, <laughs> BFG round. Gone over the boxes. We'll get this. Hang on. Perfect. <laughs> Online. Oh no, the authority is so threatening. Oh man, the resistance doesn't stand a chance. They have such good technology. Oh no! This idiot. Like, come on. This is probably harder on 360. I don't know. I, I don't know how well it went for me when I played it before. <laughs> I'm just talking shit now. <gasps> Man, they cannot handle grenades. What are these just like little like raw recruits? What's going on? <laughs> these guys just signed up. Mutants they were talking about. That's cool. They put pulse guns on their arms. They're like Mega Man. All connected. This is the start. <laughs> this is where Dr. Light got his research. <laughs>
Okay, what are the separate ammo types for this gun even good for? <laughs> Armored enemies. Okay, I guess that counts as the the authority. They're armored. These guys aren't though. But yeah, would have been a waste. Just, just spin it. Um, into the. Oh, we'll get there. Okay. <laughs> like, Switch my rounds. <laughs> Oops. You know what? Dude, this is, let's have some fun. I don't know why that guy was suddenly just a really good shot. Definitely the most powerful gun I've got. Now we'll go back to the regular rounds. I'll use them for a while. It is just a minigun, though. Very strong minigun. The other guns, uh, the other bullets work a lot better. <laughs> So much help. Crazy. I didn't switch my rounds again. Why does it keep doing that? Am I moving and like sprinting before I finish? I don't know. That would explain a lot. Whoop.
Maybe you should just be using this gun. <laughs> I'm getting plenty of ammo for it. Definitely not as fun as the BFD in other games. But I'm a I'm a fan of big explosions. But I, I understand they didn't want to give me like just a better rocket launcher. So was it the... Because the BFG in Doom was just like an orb and it blows up and hits a bunch of people. And then I, was it Quake 2 or 3 where they added the, the BFG where it had the, the little lasers that came off of it and hit things as it went through. And that was really cool too. Very fun. gun has like not enough ammo. delayed sound. <laughs> Hard difficulty, nightmare difficulty, normal difficulty. Did it all, all at once. That was it though, that was the final? The final encounter? All right. Here's where the budget went. <laughs> Dreams 
If I was going to describe rage in one word, it would be disappointing. <laughs> um, I think it it sets up a lot, but it can do better, and they have. And I don't know the story of Rage's development or what went wrong. I'm not going to say that I, I don't want anyone ever to say that, like, devs are lazy or blah, 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 blah. It, they're, they're usually not. They... <laughs> <laughs> um, there's a lot of work to put into this game, and I would say something probably happened where they were not focused on it being as fun as their previous games. So, like, I don't know, I would rate everything they did before this higher. <laughs> I liked it when I played it. Like, it's, 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 it's a solid game, but it is disappointing for what it has done before. And maybe even for what we expect these days. But, like, Doom 1 has, like, the end of each episode is, like, a big boss fight kind of thing. Like, there's a big thing that happens, and you get some, some stuff that happens. And even, like, Doom 3, there's larger encounters, and you're, like, switching weapons to do better damage to whatever you're trying to kill, and things like that. Um, even the expansion with the fucking cube was really cool. As controversial as Doom 3 was, um... Even even Quake 4, I like Quake 4 was not great, but I still remember it. <laughs> I don't remember, I remember Jack shit from Rage. So I I wonder what the misstep was here. Anyway, that's Rage. Uh you don't even unlock anything for beating the game, I don't think. So, yeah. Anyway, that's Rage. It's, it's a game. <laughs> uh, maybe I'll go through some of the games before it. Because the games that came after, right after this, they did... Um, well, they, they, they helped with Rage 2. They, they were not the only studio that worked on Rage 2. Um, and then they did Doom 2016, which is very good. But this came out in 2011, and that came out in 2016. Uh, so they had a lot of trouble with Doom 2016. <laughs> Just trying to get it to work. Uh, and then they revolutionized the first person shooter again. I mean, they did it first. And then Halo made everything worse. <laughs> and not that Halo's bad, but th the trends Halo started got really annoying. And then Call of Duty happened, I think. Um, got really big. And then that made it even worse. So the regenerating health era, this came out in. Um... <laughs> And then Doom 2016 made it really cool again. Anyway, I know next on my list is technically a game called uh, We Couldn't. It's on the PS1. It's an RPG. It's big. It's the whole thing. But this game has made me want to play a different game. And um, we're going to... We're, I'm going to throw a BRB screen and we're going to switch to that. And uh, yeah, I'm excited for the next one. So, I will be back in like a minute or two. I'm not actually getting up or anything. Anyway, be right back.